but Strumpf in a good position to welcome himself back to South Bend in a big way. And he connects on the first pitch swinging. Din's gonna, Zin's gonna come in and score. Strumpf will hold up at first with a single. A tough throw allows Roderick to get to third base. And just like that, we have a tie ball game. 1-1 here in South Bend, an RBI single from Chase Strumpf. Any more as we did for the first home series. And that one's a base hit from Velasquez. One run's gonna score easily. And here comes Chase Strumpf for a second. Derna holds up on second. It's a two RBI base hit for Nelson Velasquez. And South Bend takes the lead three to one. We'll try and turn it around. Batting average of 0.53 in Tennessee. That first pitch is it high in the air into the gap in center field. That one is going to hit the wall. Velasquez will score. Slaughter goes to second. Rounding third is Wyndham. He will score. And it's 5-1 South Bend. Josh, I'm the luckiest guy in the world. I just am. Oh, I can imagine. Still haven't been to Wrigley Field just yet as that one is lined past the shortstop base hit from Jose Teo, one run scores. Coming in to score is McAfee, so a two run, two out double from Jose Teo makes it 5-3. Ripped me up, and so yeah, that was the first thing I did, and I got lucky, both the Dodgers and the Pirates have a pretty easy uh, lineup as far the as. The one, two from Cashmore, sit back up the middle, and nice play by Uma to get the vinyl out of the inning. As that one is hit sharply into right field, base hit, scoring is Siani. And on to second is Miguel Hernandez. Just like that, it's a one-run game. Hurtabees with his first RBI of the game, and it's a 5-4 lead now for South Bend. Home runs, RBI, slugging percentage, hits. And that one is well hit into center field. Roeder on the run, can't get there. That's going to score one to tie it up. And it looks like it's going to score a second. It will. RBI double for Brian Ray. And it is 6-5 Dayton coming all the way back from a 5-1 lead.